Okay, Wagwan Keloke, we're back at it again. Yeah! Shout out to those who did show up to my Naruto early Storm Connections Crew 9 gameplay live stream. Yes, I was live streaming through YouTube, but also live streaming through Twitch at the same time. Don't ask me how. It is very complicated. The patch came out. Boys, I told you I was right about the balance patch. 1.3 version we were gonna get some nerfs and we're gonna get some buffs and the patch notes are out obviously ishiki also suski dlc pack 2 did not get nerfed ishiki wasn't gonna get nerfed in this update because when they announced the survey remember all of us took a survey when dlc pack 2 came out that survey that they brought out was version 1.3 so whatever feedback they got from that survey using the information off of that sur um, survey cc2 gave us the patch no 1.3 and um basically hagoromo got nerfed a lot of characters that i didn't expect got nerfed and also characters got buffs now there's one particular character that i'm very very excited to show off but i'm going to save it for a video and all i'm gonna say is i'm gonna give you a hint it's sasuke and that's it that's all i'm gonna say and stay tuned for the next video that i'm gonna drop what i'm gonna do is I'm, I'm gonna run like a marathon thing where i'm gonna go over all the characters that got buff and i'm gonna make a video on them because i'm very excited to use these characters why because i like using non-meta characters i'm not really really i don't really like using meta characters it's just very boring i like using the non-meta characters characters that are not really technically good but they're good if you know how to use um your fundamentals i gotta say that crew 9 feels amazing i'm not gonna say too much about crew 9 because i'm going to drop my gameplay and also review on that character so I don't want to spoil you too much. They also fix custom matches. Um, for those who don't know, when the when the update dropped on the 29th, I believe, or was it the 28th at night? Me and the Discord, we were actually the first people to discover, and you can see it right here on my post. Before the patch notes even came out, we were testing everything. We were testing what got nerfed, what what was broken. We we found out first that Hagoromo was nerfed before the patch notes even got out. We even found this aura, um, aura, I can't speak. When you switch, switch tech, um, there's this new aura that they added. You're going to see it, and I'll, and I'll show you this picture right here. It's like this blue little aura that we discovered. And it was very dope because in the Twitch, we had everybody there just watching and trying to figure out what was different about the game right um if you guys want to play with me online and stuff like that join my discord my discord is going to be in the link in my description i um go live stream here and there i don't really go live stream a lot on youtube but i noticed that a lot of you guys did enjoy um me being on um being live on youtube so i'm going to try my best to start going live on youtube more often because it seems like you guys liked it and also twitch i'm not going to forget about my twitch because we finally hit 700 followers on twitch my goal right now on youtube is to hit 4k where we're on our way we're like around 3540 subscribers and again thank you for those who um subscribe to my channel appreciate it i'm trying my best i'm trying my best to keep up with the content and stuff funny enough for those who've seen my season two potential video on youtube which they don't did great i didn't know you guys you guys loved loved it I, and thank you thank you so much it's funny when i dropped that video the same exact day the ultimate ninjas twitter page originals original page came back and i have something something good to tell you guys the ceo of cc2 tweeted this long paragraph and i summarized it for you guys and it basically said and i'll post it here right now so you guys can see it okay this is basically what i said to summarize what the ceo of cc2 said because i know a lot of people were very confused by the the tweet that he posts and plus he only writes he only communicates with people on twitter um through japanese so what i do is i always translate it. this is big news guys for the storm franchise and any future naruto games for the future summarize what piroshi underscore cc2 is saying the naruto mate underscore cc2 twitter page will be active and will start listening to the community more often and take certain requests from us and not all will be heard so basically what's going on is that this twitter page is back and i'll show you guys right here let me click on it this twitter page is back and again ironically i posted my potential season two video the same exact day 
that this was announced. So it's kind of funny. I'm not saying that CC Tour watching me. But it would be cool, right? Again, it's funny that they brought this Twitter back. And it, the last time they post something, and it's right here. You guys can see it. In 2020, April 22nd, when they dropped the Nintendo Switch version of Storm 4. And look, they're active again. So again, this is big news. This is my theory. And I got to shout this. This one of my subscribers that made this comment. Okay, so shout out to Darren the Gamer. Okay, shout out to Darren the Gamer. This is what he said. He basically, basically said this. It's actually more likely that we, that, uh, I'm sorry, it's actually more likely we'll get some su um, connection support. They're not going to want to put a new budget in another game. Only reason this game came out was cash in the anniversary. A season pass is cheaper than a full budget game. That's why Shinobi Strikers doesn't have a sequel. And the same for, um, Zeno um I'm sorry, the same for Xenoverse 2. They're going to try and stretch this as far as possible. So, again, shout out to this um, comment this comment because again i was basically telling them like listen there's a huge possibility we might get season two why because um this game didn't do well and because this game didn't do well cc2 and banda are going to try to collect their losses how are they going to try to collect their losses one by dropping accessories dlcs and skins think about it there's a huge possibility we might be getting a season two bro yes we might be getting a season two right now all i'm advocating is penalties for rank i don't care about anything else we need penalties for ranked players, and we need new modes. We need two characters versus two character modes. I'm tired of the traditional three versus three. I would like a 2v2 rank mode. Well, there you go. There you guys have it. Please drop a like, and yeah, I'm out of here, guys. Peace. Stay tuned for the next episode on Magic Kick's YouTube channel.